Hello you filthy degenerates. This is a quick video because quite frankly I can't even do this with the cur current weather because it's fucking hot as fuck. I'm sweat look I'm already quite wet just by wearing this t-shirt. Well I'm making this video at, at least this suddenly and without planning because well Epic did another epic shit. They've already snagged a few games that I was interested in, for example, The Division 2, uh, Genesis Alpha 1, Man Eater, um, Ashen kind of lost interest in that shit, and, uh, oh yeah, and Rebel Galaxy Outlaw, what the other game, I don't care anymore. They fucking made exclusive exclusives, and I fucking hate exclusive deals. I hated it back in the day when Games for Windows Live was exclusive, because I fucking hated that ge goddamn program. But even worse for me, because, well, uh, I don't have the regional pricing, or I can't afford paying the fees, for example, of payment processes that Steam, or Valve in this case, eats up or absorbs. They they just don't charge me that. And using on with Epic, uh, that charge gets back to me, especially conversion, uh, converting, for example, dollars to my local currency. And it's, a, it's horrible that the conversion rating and it just becomes way way more expensive than buying on Steam and they don't have a proper infrastructure here in this country so it means that my download speeds doesn't even come close to what I get on Steam and this is just fucking ridiculous and here are some of the uh, some of the stuff that I got it from Gamma Sutra, and I added my own. Uh, that means I expanded a few things on the list that the guy did. The journalist, game journalist. Well, at least this one was honest. Uh, I, uh, I've decided to expand it. For example, adding Proton, offline gaming, Steam curators, developer pages, news related to to gaming. You are viewing on your in your game library. This is sorting, says streaming from your PC to TV, and many other things. We'll get all that on Steam, and on Epic, this is what we get. Uh, friends list, with block on block functionality, we do already have that on Steam. DRM free packages, which is optional, we do have that on Steam too. Refunds, we have that on Steam. Limited regional pricing, more regions to come in 2019. Doubtful if they will serve my region anytime soon. Uh, the lack of user reviews, reviews and discussions is considered a feature for Epic. Yes, there will not be reviews and discussions for games, but uh, they kind of buckled down, uh, buckled a little on that one and said that they will add reviews for only for developers and publishers who want it. So that means the majority doesn't want it. So you barely even have that. Discussions, you'll not get it. And now to the cherry on top of this disgraceful little shit pile. Like, uh, this is this is like a dumpster fire where, where that dumpster is filled with shit and baby poo with baby diapers in there burning. You know that smell. So, guess what? Metro Exodus is now an Epic Store exclusive. They are going to at least honor some of the purchases. Well, not. Well, honor the purchases up until a few hours from now. Because they are pulling this game out of the Steam store. I can't afford it to buy it now. I, I had set up some money to buy it around February 10th or thereabouts, but I can't afford it now, so I can't get it on Steam. In other words, hoist the colors! God damn it! God fuck you, Epic! Fuck you with a 
big gigantic pineapple without fucking lube and and this pineapple is not going to get in on the softer side it's going to get on the leafy side you know the the one that hurts your hand it's gonna go through that fuck you epic really and the worst thing of our of epic is that the 40 percent of epic is owned by a chinese company tencent the chinese company is also responsible for the uh chinese social credit system that we keep seeing that people get the i don't even need to go in details on that one holy fuck what the fuck is wrong with you epic epic you are, i know you already hate pc gamers you pretty much made that clear 10 years or so ago when you said that uh pc gamers were all pirates well thank you for making us even more into piracy because well look at this mess uh, it's just making it harder for people to acquire games you should make it easier this is monopoly you have to make it available on other stores. If you make it available on other stores, then it's not a monopoly. This is exclusivity. This is a monopoly. You're a fucking idiot. Uh, I, I, uh, I'm speechless, dude. I don't even know what to say. This is just fucking wrong. And the ratio between comments and likes we already can see how bad it is 1201 comments uh, let me down uh, give a refresh 1217 comments by now and look people are pissed we can this is just wrong stop doing that epic i know you hate us i know you hate pc games i, I know you hate pc but fucking stop it already if you want uh, us to finally warm up to what you're doing at least don't fucking backstab us like this be i don't know stop just stop if you what well uh, only now i was starting to kind of forgive them for what they said about pc gamers years ago but after this I don't think I can forgive them in 10 years. Only now I'm, I was starting to forgive them for what they said about PC gamers being all pirates. But now, just fuck you. Epic, fuck you. Well, that's how I have to say, uh, my beautiful degenerates. You filthy degenerates. I love all you guys. So, uh, see you later. Probably making more videos as I go, but... As long as this heat makes it more tolerable, this one is just... Ugh. Fuck you! Epic, fuck you!